Today we're going to make multimedia star art. We'll use a variety of art techniques and materials to create a variety of interesting stars on either an individual artwork or on a large collaborative artwork. Let's gather our materials. The materials we'll need for our multimedia star art include art paper, and this could either be individual sheets of paper or it could be a large sheet of craft paper or easel paper or a large poster board or something like that. You'll also need drawing tools and this could be any drawing tool you like. It could be crayons, oil pastels, pencils, anything you like. You'll want some stars for printing and you can use a star shaped cookie cutter. You can use a sponge cut into a star shape or you can use a potato with a star shape cut out of one half of the potato. Or you can be creative and find other stars around you and use those to print with. You'll also need tempera paint in a shallow dish and some paper stars and these can be stars that you cut freehand out of colored construction paper or any paper with scissors or you can use a star shaped paper punch to punch out star shapes. Let's create! To make your multimedia star art, simply create stars with your different materials and techniques. To draw stars, you'll use your drawing tools to draw small and large stars all over your paper, any size, any color, anywhere you like. To print stars, press your star-shaped sponge or your star-shaped cookie cutter to the paint and then to your paper. And again, repeat to make as many star prints as you like, in as many colors as you like, anywhere you like on the paper. You can layer prints, you can layer your printed star on top of a star that you drew. You can layer a printed star on top of another printed star. That's the fun part about multimedia art sometimes is layering different techniques and materials. And then paste stars. You will glue paper stars to your artwork Again, anywhere you like. You can make small paper stars and large paper stars. You can make paper stars in different colors. And then glue them to your artwork anywhere you like. And then finally, let your star art dry. I hope you enjoy this art activity. And you can frame this for the wall. You can use it as wrapping paper, gift wrap, or you can give it as a gift. Let's explore. 